Welcome to Rick's Corner, brought to you by Old School Labs, the brand I trust and the only one I put my name to. Use my code, Drayson12, on the link below. Welcome to Rick's Corner, the man, the myth, the legend. Now on with the show. Welcome to Rick's Corner. I have Lorelai back who's been on the show before, as you know, and she teaches uh, exercise in the water in the pool, which is really good for you. And I just can't go in yet till the holes in my legs heal up. Otherwise, my holes will fill up with water and I'll get bloated and I'll... <laughs> <laughs> anyway, we're going to talk a little bit about pre-workouts, right? Yes, yes. That's been a pretty hot topic at the gym. Well, there's many, many kinds of pre-workouts. You can buy so many different brands nowadays. And back in the older days, people would just drink a cup of coffee and go to the gym. Yes, exactly. That was the best pre-workout is cappuccino or coffee or espresso. Yeah, actually it is. I mean, it's not the best thing for your heart because no. it fires it up quite a bit and it can raise your blood pressure. But I've done years and years without a pre-workout and um, I've had great workouts. But lately, I've been taking the one I told you about, Old School Labs. Yes, yes, Old School Labs, this and I'm going to get some samples. This is not a plug for Old School Labs. I just happen to like their stuff. So I take the workout, and I take another supplement. By the time I get to the gym, I'm pretty much fired up to go. I'm not shaky, and I'm not jittery and all that stuff, but I feel good. Yeah, that's exactly I'm a pre-workout junkie. I'm like Rick, who doesn't need the pre-workouts. I love pre-workouts, but I've been a mother, a grandmother, very busy lady. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, I need a little bit of mojo when I get to the gym. Do you wake up tired? No, I get up, but I'm pretty much going pretty quickly. But, you know, I start real early and I put a lot of energy energy into my clients and to other people, you know, and yeah. it tends to, you start petering out. Peter? Peter. <laughs> 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 I, I, I got to watch term. myself around this guy. I've heard that term in a long time. Never a dull moment. I don't wake up tired. And, and as some people say, oh, man, I can hardly get out of bed. I don't have any problem. I don't wake up tired. I wake up with that sore in my leg, but once I get past that, I'm okay to go. And no hair in your head. I don't need hair in my head. Yeah, no. No. Nope. It's cute. Bald yeah. is beautiful. It is. Uh, you, you wear know, it well. You know they say the less hair you have, the more head you get. So <laughs> this is how it works. But the um, I have a breakfast, and then before I go to the gym, I do my pre-workout. I just started doing it. But what I found it does for me is it makes me talk a lot. Um, Yes, he turns into a chatty. I do, I do, and it's 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 and I, my wit, my thinking is like really sharp when I have it, and as far as just joking around and being funny, it just it works. So if I was ever going to do a stand-up comedy, I would take the pre-workout before I go on stage. Definitely, definitely. Isn't that weird how that does that? Yeah. Well, it it elevates everything, and that's the whole idea. Is it opens up your your system where it makes your it should. That is, if it's not full of niacin and caffeine and everything else. You know. I was told that uh, a lot of comedians, before they go on, they'll take a beta blocker. That the heart pill that slows you down, it just slows everything down, and it calms you when you go on stage. I uh, but I don't think I'd want to do that. I'd rather be fired up to go. Yeah, yeah, no, I couldn't see you But the, the uh, pre-workout lasts me, I do like maybe 45 minutes to an hour tops, and I get all the way through it, and there's no letdown at the end. I just feel like I, I can just go throughout the day with the whole thing. Exactly. I mean, a good pre-workout, you take it about 20 minutes before your workout. Mm -hmm. It helps get you that extra little jump start mm -hmm. on your workout, so that way you get, get in there and get it done. Now, when you're in the water in your training, it's different than lifting weights. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. But it's still every bit as intense as working out in the gym, except you don't overheat and you don't have that gravity. But unlike being in the water and like being in the gym is we go from one cycle to the next and you're working opposing muscle groups at exactly the same time. So there's no having to get your weight set up for the next exercise. You're just going from one to the next to the next to the next. Do you work, do you work like, does it work like body parts or is the whole body all the time? The whole body, but specifically body parts. Yeah. It's interesting. Yeah. I, I like the, the resistance on something like that. Oh. Um, it's not, it's not the type of workout that's going to put muscle on you. No. If you're a bodybuilder and if you want to get shredded and get bulky, this is not the one for you. But if you have some injuries or if you want to cross train or you want to cut and sculpt or you have, uh, have other issues as far as with balance and, and flexibility, it's perfect. Now, with a the pre-workout, there's other supplements to take, like there's proteins and there's amino acids. And mm -hmm. I talked about these, um, these 
grass-fed beef liver pills I've been taking for a while now that give me a ton of energy, and they have B12 and niacin and uh, iron in them and kelp, which kelp is a fat burner. Yes, yes, definitely. So I take six of those a day. They said take three and three, but sometimes I'll do like 10 a day. And I feel that in my workout. And I used to take a protein drink after my workout. I always do. Well, I did for a long time. And then someone said to me well, years ago, no, no, you need glycogen. Take some sugar. So um, it goes back into the muscle. So I do. Th I might do some protein, but then I'll do a little sugar with it just because I want to push it back in. And it seems to make a difference. If, if I'm trying to gain size, for example, it, it will work for me that way. But uh, there's so many protein drinks that do. Some do have sugar in them. But I take the amino acid powder. I think I, that's actually better. Yeah, well, I'm again, me, what works for me is I go right into the juice bar uh, where I work, and mm -hmm. I, they have a protein drink made for me. Got just enough sugar in it, the flavors and everything that goes in there, peanut butter and chocolate, a little bit of banana. Ooh. I'm good to go. Mm. That sounds good. Yeah, it's like a Reese's Pieces in my cup. The banana appeals to me. Yeah, with the potassium, it tastes good. <laughs> I like bananas a whole bunch. <laughs> and I have a banana a day. Yeah. Yeah. Everybody really should. Yeah. Yeah. Just like I that. also eat apples. Yes. That's what I was just gonna say. Mike Sable was the one that introduced me. He says have an apple in ten almonds. I count them out in between all of my meals. Oh, for the fats? Mm -hmm. Well the apple a, a day they came back years ago, they said mm -hmm. an apple a day keeps the doctor away. Yes, exactly. And I used to go out with the doctor's wife, so I'd have an <laughs> apple before I go over. <laughs> Just kidding. But I think it's good fiber. It is. It's very good. Um, but I, I think it's good fiber to have that and, and the supplements. And, you know, there's so many supplements you can take, and I can't possibly take them all. So I kind of, like, rotate some things, and um, I take my vitamins and folic acid and B12 and vitamin D, which is important, kelp, magnesium, uh, and I'm doing the collagen now in my protein because it's great for the skin. And it's also helped my leg heal up. So uh, I, I see a big splash on Facebook and s social media about collagen. A lot of the protein companies are putting collagen in everything. And it's definitely, it's a muscle builder, but it also helps your skin and tissue rebuild. So if mm -hmm. it's going to help tissue rebuild, it will help your muscle rebuild. Oh, yeah. So and your legs just look and feel so much better than they did. The they do, don't they? So, yeah. You've noticed? Yeah, he was like the rubber man. I came up and I said, all right, I'm going to fill your leg. <laughs> no, I was holding was. a lot of water from like, my entry, and it was, and it was driving me crazy. And so they, uh, they have a nurse that comes over for this these things in my leg that were holes where they're healing up and it seems like the past month they've healed from the collagen yeah tremendous and what's Just really, really funny good. the nurse would bring her own collagen that was a medical grade collagen and i said i have a bottle of it right there and she looked at it the one i got from old school lab she said it's the same thing yeah exactly. so now they use that and it's doing the same job yeah old school it's got good stuff it's good stuff well yeah. i'm old school that's me uh, uh, me too it's the only way to go uh -huh. i was talking to somebody about old school mechanics because my dad used to have a mechanic that used to work on cars when I was a kid. He said, I'll take it over him, he'll fix your car. And a guy always came out to my car with a wrench in his hand. He looked like he's gonna beat me up. But the mechanics back then, old school guys, had these huge forearms. And it was from working with screwdrivers and wrenches all day long. And oh, nowadays, yeah. everything's power tools. Yeah, exactly. So it's not the same deal. Yeah. All right, so. Uh, oh, the man with big forearms, you know, he's been working. Where can people uh, get in touch with you if they want to reach out to you? Well, I have a website, as you know. It's www.aqua-tone.com. Mm -hmm. And uh, just that easy. Or What's the WWW right stand for? World Wrestling Federation? <laughs> yes! You know, people say that. World H Wild like, Women uh, uh, Federation. HTTP colon forward slash forward slash www. When you can basically just type in the name and it comes yeah. up. Aqua-tone.com. Okay, he got me. It's, it's so much easier. Yeah. So aqua-tone.com. Okay. Yeah. And that's all your stuff's on there. Yeah, everything. A way to get in touch with me and everything else. Okay. Um, stay tuned for more Works Corners. Laura, I was nice enough to drive out here a long distance to do this show for no, me. No, not that far. Not for you. No, yeah. I'm well worth it. Yes, he is. <laughs> yeah. So thank you guys for watching the show, and we'll see you all next time. Good night. Say goodbye. Hope Bye. you enjoyed the video brought to you by Old School Labs. Use my discount code Drayson12 on the link below at OldSchoolLabs.com. Hey, everyone. Now you can have the Gold's Gym logo drawn by me, the artist Rick Drayson personalized and made out to you and signed by me to frame and put on your gym wall or wherever you see fit to do so. It's a piece of bodybuilding history. It will never be duplicated again. It's the largest selling icon t-shirt logo in the world. And I'm the guy that drew it and I will draw it for you. Just go to my website, rickdrazen.com and order there. You can pay through PayPal and it'll be sent out right away. And be sure to watch Rick's Corner for all the videos on bodybuilding, nutrition, fitness, pro wrestling, and anything that suits your interests as far as getting physically fit and being the best you can be from the golden era of bodybuilding.
Pfizer, baby. See you next time.